back out to I-80. That's where a multi-vehicle crash has closed westbound lanes of Interstate 80 near the East Mixmaster. That's also where we find Ticia Muzinga. I am so glad that you're OK for one to hear that you are. But you've been out there for about an hour now. Can you tell me what has changed? What have you seen change out there, Ticia? What has changed? What have you seen change out there, Ticia? What has changed? What have you seen Yeah, uh, it, it was a very scary scene. I'm going to actually fold the side here. It's a lot calmer now. Uh, I did speak to a few people who are just happy that they're okay and that they're safe. Right now, they're just kind of clearing out the roads and clearing out the scene. So far, we aren't hearing if anyone is hurt, but I'm kind of just going to walk you through what happened and what I saw. We were recording, uh, getting B-roll of a small little accident, and as we got into our car, we looked up and all of a sudden we just saw semis, semis running into each other one after another another car is just kind of pulling out to the to the side and, and it wasn't too far from our car so it was very scary and our photographer my photographer and i we went up in the hill and 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 just kind of you know scoped the area and, and started reporting but so far uh, you see the scene right there it's very bad uh but it is clearing out and and so far i've not heard of anyone being severely hurt. We did hear that one man is stable and that was caught into this accident here, but we're going to continue to follow this whole big pileup that happened here. Uh, the big thing that, you know, a lot of people can take away from this incident is that, you know, when it snows like this, even though it wasn't a lot, slow down and be careful. There was slick roads. It was very icy and the visibility was so bad that people didn't even realize how backed up the roads were until it was too late. But again, just kind of went around and talked to people and they're just happy that they're okay. And we're going to continue to follow the story throughout the day and as soon as it clears out. But I'm going to send it back to you. We are live here. I'm TC Musinga for KCCI 8 News. I was News Leader.